Good afternoon and welcome back to another episode of The Longing. And today we are going to hopefully be exploring this upper area, if we can actually reach. Because it looks like this mushroom has grown as expected. So it seems like if we put a green mushroom to the left of a purple mushroom, which is a glowy mushroom, it will cause the glowy mushroom um, to swell and grow to a large size. Um, so we are going to go and try it out. Climb. There we go. We can indeed climb on the mushroom. Oh, and we bounce. Ho ho ho. That is pretty cool. I can't believe this actually worked either. Nice. So we're in a whole new area now. And we've instantly lost the music. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That is pretty cool. Um, it seems to be getting narrower and potentially a little bit darker the further in we go. It's certainly going. <clears throat> Interesting. Now I'm just quite happy that we found a new area to explore, to be honest. It's getting thinner and thinner. If this is a dead end with a d disappointment, I'm going to be ooh, mildly annoyed. However, we will have found a new trick. I've just realized we won't be able to take any of the mushrooms out of that area because in order to climb, we have to have our hands free, which means we can't use that trick anywhere else for the time being. Which is mildly annoying. Not a problem. Just mildly annoying because it's something I would like to play around with. Um, it's getting really quite dark in here, actually. The shade has almost disappeared into the background, into the shade of the, uh, of the scenery. Interesting. Okay. Really is quite dark. And it feels like it's possibly getting darker. Oh, we're crawling again. I didn't even see that coming up. This would be where, this is somewhere it'd be really handy to have one of the glowy mushrooms. Really is dark down here. This place is so dark that even I can't see anything without a light. It really is dark. I very much am struggling to see. Can just about make out the floor. Just barely. Uh, looks like we might be standing up in a minute. Yep, there we go. <clears throat> but my word, that is dark. Oh wow, I lost the f vision of the floor then for a second. Good grief. I, r I really can't see what's going on here. I'm slightly concerned that we're just going to fall off. <laughs> Maybe we should stop 
I wonder if closing our eyes would do anything. I mean, it certainly can't hurt. We're already basically blind at this point. We are. I, I, I cannot see a thing. Oh. Maybe I should turn back. I'm starting to hear strange sounds. There is background noise. It is coming through. It is slightly concerning. Do we move on? I mean, we've got to, haven't we? <laughs> I'm trying different angles on the screen to see if I can see anything. But no matter what angle I go at, I can't see anything. Genuinely concerned that I'm just going to fall off something. Hmm. Let's inch our way forward. We're going up and down. If something's going to jump out at me, I'm not going to be impressed. Feels like we're going up. Just keep swimming. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, the audio stopped there for a minute, but I think it was just it restarting the track. This is weird. Oh, <gasps> is that path? I can see something. It's zooming out. We do seem to be on a path of some description. Oh. I can feel my end nearing. Wait, wait a minute. Hang on, hang on, hang on. That is just, a, that's not a path. That is the underside of a cliff. Yeah. Hmm. Yep, we're not going to go any closer than that. Nope, we're turning back. I don't, I'm not trusting it. <laughs> but that, that leaves the question of what do we do? <laughs> because I don't want, I don't want to try jumping off. I can just see that being my death. So, as we get further away, we zoom back in. I think what we do, since we've got to wait the night, wait until tomorrow anyway, because we're basically at the end of the episode, I think we wait slightly more in the light, 
sure we're looking out at a precipice that appears to just fall. And we're not going to go down the precipice. Don't worry about that. We are staying alive. Um, it does mean that I've got to work out what we do next. Now, I do have a slight theory that if we, if we stand here with our eyes closed, we might figure our way through the, through the layout for some reason. I don't know why, but I get the strange feeling that standing in the dark is, um, is going to be a good thing. No idea why. But either way, <laughs> we're going to wait here because I need to figure out what we're going to do. We're not going over that precipice, that's for certain. So, if you want more, be sure to come back tomorrow uh, to figure out what, to, to see what we end up doing. Because we're going to try and work our way back, I guess, if this fails uh, and if closing our eyes doesn't help either. So, I hope you all have a wonderful morning, evening, afternoon or night, no matter what time of day it is. Have a wonderful one of it. And as always, we will be back tomorrow with more of The Longing. Goodbye.